Hey guys, today I'm going to talk to you about Shadows over Innistrad game day. I tried to go to the game day at my locals, but I couldn't make it, and then there was another one at 4 o'clock, 4 p.m. I called, and it was the most... It was a interesting experience. So this is the same store that I made that original video about, kind of like the weirdest magic store ever, and I wasn't trying to give negative or... So this store is actually moving to another location soon. Uh, but I called about game day and they said, yeah, we have the mat, we have the promos. And I was like, what is the format? And they said, the format is either booster draft or intro deck. So right off the bat, I was like, huh, intro deck format, that's kind of weird. And I was like, oh, okay, so how many people do you have? And they said, we don't have anyone. And then I was trying to figure out how to, and how many people do you need? Now, I know that the correct amount is eight players, but they told me four players, and then four players would get the promo, sounded like a really good deal. I started contact, I would have contacted my friends, and we would have gone over to the store, if not for the fact that they essentially said on the phone, hey, you know, I have a D&D game, I gotta get back to you, I'm gonna hang up now, bye. And, you know, I'm trying to set up this game day, at the store to help it out, more or less, and that's what they said. They said, nope, we're not going to do game day, and because we, I need to get back to a D&D game. So I'm a little surprised. It is kind of far away to drive to, so I wouldn't normally drive to it unless I knew game day was happening, and there was no, like, there was not like, hey, get together, get your friends together, and then we'll do a game day at 4 p.m. There's no time they just told me that the game day was at 4 p.m., but no one showed up, and they just didn't feel like having one. Now, I'm not going to put the store in blast, but a lot of just weird stuff happens at the store. Uh, they either don't have enough promos, they, they sell a ton of magic product, but it's not at the greatest prices. And secondly, I've never heard of a game day where it's introduction pack sealed. Like, it doesn't make any sense to me. So I was going to actually just do call my friends up, go head to the store, which is kind of a drive away, and just have a game day with probably eight people. But I didn't get to the conversation long enough because the guy had to go do do D and D. He was part of a D and D game, and that's you know I've also seen this quite a bit. So I pretty much are going to cut my burn the bridge to the store. I know I did complain about it previously, and then you might ask, why do you keep going back? Why do you keep going back? Because it's really close to one of my friends who, whenever I want to see his collection or uh, purchase part of the collection, it makes sense for me to go to that store and then head over to my friends uh, to hang out. But yeah, such a weird experience. Like, it's just, it's not that they're not operating correctly, because that's besides the point, which might, you might argue yes or no, that the game day was not, you know, properly organized and not properly promoted so that there would be people and maybe they didn't want the game day to happen. The, one of the other times in my video, I talked about how there wasn't enough promos. I just, I don't know, you get a promo pack of eight and somehow they only had four promos. Uh, it's a mystery, yes. Uh, so, did you guys have fun at game day? Um, how was your game day? Did you do well? Did you get to play? Now there's a game day Sunday, but I'm probably not going to go there because I'm busy with work. But yeah, I've, man, I've done extremely well. I, I've done extremely well game days and that was very unfortunate I couldn't make this particular game day happen. Although, you know, so here's a customer saying, hey, I'm going to bring in seven more customers and we're going to play this game and we're going to all buy this intro deck. I guess we're going to do intro deck and of Innistrad and we'll compete against each other and it actually sounded kind of fun but you know instead of you know telling you're know, setting a time and saying hey Eric, that's good we'll do it we'll hold the uh, tournament or we'll, we'll give you the playmat and the prizes should you do that should you get certain people to buy intro decks or should you get free other people to buy intro decks we'll have the tournament instead they just said hey I gotta get back to my Dungeons and Dragons game so I'm going to hang up the phone now. <laughs> it's kind of like they don't want to make money. Uh, is that, have you heard of a local game store like that where either they have customers and they just don't want to sell stuff, they don't want to have the tournament. 
I mean, I just cannot imagine the game store where here's a potential customer and a lot of other potential customers and you won't have the event that you're supposed to have that day. So leave me a comment below. How was your game day? Have you ever had experience with a store like this where it's complexing because I'm going to give you money. My friends are going to give you money. And instead of saying, yes, oh, cool, we'll, we'll hold the event, which will bring new players to this locals, you say, I got to get back to my Dungeons and Dragons game, which we'll talk about a little later. Bye, guys.